Hey, what's up? I'm going to show you how to use the line emojis in WeChat. I want to add them to the default. So I've already added a few and I'm going to show you how to add new ones. So the first thing you want to do is go to the Play Store and install this app, the ES File Explorer File Manager. So I'm going to click on Install, Accept, Start Loading. Okay, we are opening the app. And so this app allows you to go see all the files in your Android phone. So, first thing is you need to click on your local button and go to the second home uh, tab I guess and for, we want to change the view to small to have all the details of each folders now we need to find the line directory so I clicked on let me do it again so we are home, it's slash SD, slash SD card, uh, Android, Android data, we need to scroll down to find gp.never.line.android, click on it, and then you will find directory called stickers at least in my phone and probably most phone it's in the directory number two you can see that there are there are a lot of items in that directory so you're going to click on it and you will find the directory with all these files and if we click on if we try to open one says open as we open as image we select an app and we find those very cute images and if you try to open the file with the key suffix you I guess it's the same image but smaller so we, we probably want to just to grab the um, regular files with with no suffix with no key suffix so you need to go and one by one and find the one you wanna use so let's say you wanna use this one well let's try to find another one a little bit more fun okay this one is good we wanna ask a lot of questions so what you're going to do is do a long press on it and select it and click on copy here. So copy. Then you want to go back here on the menu and go to download. And you're going to past here with the that button. So you passed your file. So your file is here, you can take a look again, make sure that's the one you want. So this is it. And what we the what we need to do now is to do a long press on that file and use the rename option. And what we want to do is to add the, the, the suffix dot png. G with no space which basically tells the app that it's an image file so now you can see it and if we go in WeChat you have the regular ones and you have this hurt one where you can add customized one so you want to press this plus button again the plus button here 
and your image should show up directly um, if it doesn't you can try to find it here with all of your images so if you go to the download directory you can find it select it um, you can see it click OK it says adding it's added now you can use it it shows up here I'm going to go back into the file explorer and show you how to copy multiple files at the same time because you don't want to do that file by file so if you go actually so you need to go back to the line directory in our case if you click on one of those button on the top you should be able to go back to the directory you were in otherwise you need to go back uh, as I've shown before and <clears throat> we're not going to look at all of them but we're going to select a bunch of them so just the file without the suffix key So you can select all of them if you want. Um, I'm just showing you how to select a few of them. I'm going to copy, and if you go back to the download directory, here you are. Click on Fast. It passes all these files. Select all of your files. that you've copied and do a rename just rename extension name add the dot png ok so you have all of your files here now if you go in WeChat app go back to the this customized screen too fast click the plus so you have your library with all of these emojis that you've just copied and click OK and you can do that for all of those and you can repeat that operation with all of them and now See, we've added these two and you can add all of them and use them so I hope you like that I uh, hope it helps um, the line emojis are really nice so it's really nice to be able to use them in WeChat